What's going on guys? I started off with clean hair. This is what my hair looks like when it's dry. I re-wet my hair with water. Wet hair makes my hair easier to manage. I then section my hair to make my hair more manageable and I'll continue to make smaller sections as I go along. The first product is Shea Moisture's Curl Enhancing Smoothie. I actually used to dislike this product but I tried it again and my hair actually loves it. My hair dries up pretty quickly so spray bottle on deck. Detangle hair is very important to get out all the shit hair and to smooth out my curls making product application much better back to my favorite eco styler gel for my wash and goes this can be paired with any product and holds better in the colder months without drying out my hair use the denman brush to help smooth out my curls and to reduce frizz my wash and goes usually turns out popping with less frizz when I do this plopping method and make sure my hair is smoothed down so I spend some time smoothing my hair with my fingers after using the denman brush the more I I smooth the longer my hair will last I smooth my hair into smaller sections that willingly separate that section is finished now on to the rest let's go over the process one more time as stated earlier I'm using the Shea Moisture's Curl Enhancing Smoothie as my moisturizer thoroughly detangle hair from any knots tangles and shed hair apply Eco Styler gel and smooth it onto my hair continue to make my sections smaller for easier application I also implement the Denman brush to further detangle and smooth out my curls. Smooth my curls with my fingers and let them willingly separate. All done but not quite. You're probably wondering why I left the hair out in the front of my hair. Well I'm going to use a different product that doesn't give as much hold as the Echo Sila since my edges are so fragile. And I came to the realization that slick edges are breaking your edges off and leaving you with no so edges. So what did I use? I used the Shea Moisture's Curling Gel Souffle. A little of this goes a lot. Way. Dun dun dun! I'll continue smoothing parts and separate where I see fit. Now it's time to let this dry. I'm gonna show you guys how my hair dries throughout a couple of hours so you guys can get an idea how my hair looks when it dries. my hair dries, I also randomly separate my curls some more for more volume. Here I'm showing you guys that I can also achieve a side part if I wanted to. I got options. At this point, my hair is pretty dry. The only thing that's not dry are my roots. But I like it to dry like this so I can have more volume for when I swoop it up. My hair isn't the softest right now because some of my hair still has the gel cast. I'll use my Natural Oasis Hair and Skin Conditioner. Either that one or the Honey Cream Liquid Balm out of Hova Balm to soften up my hair. Sometimes I do give my hair a little volume but I want my hair to last a little while so I won't necessarily keep separating. I'll just let it get big on its own front i kind of use too much product in the front but i can just add water because i usually do not wear my hair out unless i'm going out or for photographs honestly i usually have my hair up because i'm usually at the gym and i don't like having hair in my face when i work out but if i do go out then i'll really like style it and make it look big and whoosh, 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 whoosh. so i'm gonna come back to the next hour in a bit. My hair is pretty dry for the most part. I'm applying my Natural Oasis Honey Cream Liquid Balm to soften my hair. Going to scrunch that all in over my hair and prepare for bed. My hair is soft, moisturized, and defined, but my roots are still a bit wet. I'm going to show you guys how I prepare my hair for bed so that my hair lasts longer and it stays defined, stays moisturized. To prepare my hair for bed, I bring all my hair forward to mimic a pineapple without the elastic band while putting on a satin bonnet. Although I do sleep on a satin pillowcase, to ensure that my hair stays moisturized, I would continue wearing a bonnet. I took my bonnet off and you gotta shake it off. And sh I shake my hair and shape it and fluff to my liking. You guys heard me mention Natural Oasis Liquid Balm so often and it's making an appearance. I reapply the Honey Cream Liquid Balm daily to keep my hair soft and shiny. You guys heard me mention going to the gym. 
I'm on my way to the gym, so I'll show you guys how I put my hair up. Middle section will serve as bangs, and I'll take my edges out so I won't put too much tension on them from the ponytail holder. I'm gonna put my hair up in a high ponytail with a ponytail holder. Take the pieces of hair I left out in the front and loosely tuck them under. The same process is repeated daily until my hair dries out and this style lasted for about 5 days. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye!